Hello, Korea. My name is Mario Winans. Working with ID was a great experience, man. It was my first time collaborating with an Asian artist. Um, it was very enjoyable. I liked the song. Um, and we got it done, man. But it was definitely a great experience. And I, I would definitely be open to doing it again. Well, I would say um, as far as collaboration and featuring, um, the most memorable songs I, I have to say was with my brother Puffy. Um, we had great success. Uh, on our songs that we collaborated with. We actually have like five, maybe six records we collaborated with. That's the most, he's the most, uh, per he's the person I've collaborated with the most and has the most success with collaborating with, man. So I definitely have to say Puffy. Um, the songs I can say um, are pretty much the same songs that we did together, I Don't Wanna Know, I Need a Girl, Part Two, um, the gospel song, Best Friend, um, Through the Pain, um, so yeah, those, those, I would definitely say my brother Puffy, man. Well, as an artist, I would recommend a song called, um, Three Days Ago, that was on my Hurt No More album, a song called Don't Know, that was on my first album that came out on Motown in the 90s. Um, but then as far as some of my production, um, I'm sure One Twelve Peaches and Cream made it over there, or even, uh, Trey Songz Can't Be Friends, which was, um, 16 weeks of number one that I produced um, last night with Puff and Keisha Cole or Beyonce Summertime, just to name a few of them. Well, I'm actually doing my due diligence to, and research to uh, um, get into the hip hop in Korea. I've heard a lot about it. I know there's a big, big hip hop community. Um, just as far as uh, an Asian Asian um, artist period with the the um, break dancing and the whole movement of hip hop over there with the way they dress and stuff like that. So, um, but you know, I have yet to get that deeply involved in it, but I look forward to, to getting involved with it in the very near future. Yeah, I'm actually working on my new album right now. It's called the Mask Off album. And what that means is basically, you know, a lot of people think that um, I was just an art, just this artist that, hit the scene in 2004 with this song, I Don't Wanna Know, but they failed to realize that I had, I have 25 years in the game under my belt as a producer. Um, I've sold over 150 million records as a producer, and I've produced for, well, with some of the greatest artists, Jay-Z, Beyonce, Brandy, um, the late Whitney, Puffy, uh, Faith Evans, 112, Trey Songs, um, you name it, the list is, is very vast, and um, so I'm very proud of that. Um, so those, those are some things that I'm working on, but, but my new album is definitely coming very soon. Absolutely. I'm actually planning on doing, um, just a, a massive, a ma making a massive impression in Korea and, um, just in the Asian market because I haven't really done that as of yet. I wanted to, I wanted it to be correct when I went and did some things. So from production to some of the artists over there, some of the biggest artists, as well as up and coming artists, and um, a slew of shows. So I, I definitely plan to do that very soon. Korea, get ready for Mario Winans, man. We're getting ready to break through the barriers over there. We're coming over there to produce with some of your greatest artists, We're coming over there to develop some of your new artists and new talent. And um, I'm coming over there to bring a lot of love.